Hi, and a warm welcome to the inside of my iPhone. This is the very first lecture, and I'm using my iPhone as you're looking at the screen right now, but I will be alternating back and forth between my iPad and my iPhone throughout this course. So you're welcome inside both of them. So this first lecture is for complete beginners only. I'm gonna show you how to set up a new account in a skeleton form, so not optimized or no new information here. If you already have an account, you don't need to know anything in this lecture. So go ahead and click the little gray tick in the bottom right of your screen that says mark this lecture as complete. Excellent. If you're still here, it means you don't have an account yet. So let's go ahead and get you one now. So first thing I want to point out, as you can see, Instagram is already downloaded to my device. If it's not on your device yet, simply go to the Google Play Store or the App Store, depending on what sort of software you're running, and search for Instagram, download it to your phone, and then once it's installed, you can simply click it, like I just clicked my Instagram right there, and it'll come up loading the program. So one thing I really want to stress before we get into creating our account is this is just getting the foundation of our account created. Everything we do in this lecture is changeable and we will be changing pretty much everything we do in the next module in order to optimize our account to attract our target audiences. So the default screen on Instagram is login. We don't want to log in because we don't have an account. So we're going to click the sign up button on the left. It gives you two options. You can log in with Facebook or you can sign up with an email address. So, so I'm gonna be using an email address, so I'm gonna go ahead and type that in now. Use your business email address to sign up. Click Next once you've typed it in. It's gonna get you to create a username and a password on this first page. So username, it'll suggest one for you. I recommend just putting in the name of your business. Once again, I'm gonna go over all the information in the next module. So create a password. And you can see there's a little photo adding option at the top. You can click that and add your photo. I'm not gonna do this right now, and you don't have to either, because I'm gonna show you exactly what sort of photo you want there in the next module. So click the arrow on the top right to proceed. It's gonna ask you if your email address is correct. Simply click yes. Now, what people want you to do is they want you to put in your name and your number. They say it makes it easier for your friends and your customers to find you on Instagram. So you can go ahead and put in your full name. And I'm gonna leave my phone out for number out of this, but I do recommend you put your business phone number in there. So next. What I want you to do now is to get a foundation of friends and followers so that when you are inside the app in the future, you can use it as if you're a regular user and there's just not nothing happening. So we're not gonna do this right now because I am once again gonna give you a starter mission in the very next lecture, which will be exactly this task. So I'm gonna click skip in the top right. It's gonna also ask you to upload contacts. Once again, we skip that. So discover people. This is gonna ask you to follow people that are popular on Instagram in order to populate your newsfeed and your Instagram app with content. In the next lecture, I'm gonna be showing you exactly who you should be following and why you should be following them in order to learn Instagram the quickest way possible. But right now, I'm just gonna follow one person so you can see how it's done. That little follow button next to Instagram, I'm just gonna click on that and then click their name and I'm following them. Now the top left is the back button. I'm going back to the page and I'm just gonna click done, which is in the top right. Awesome, so congratulations because you now have an Instagram account. It may look a little bit confusing for you right now. I'm gonna go through the main features really quickly for you so you know how to navigate the app, but you'll be learning slowly throughout the course so it's not gonna be too detailed. This right here is your newsfeed. So anyone that you're following, remember I just followed Instagram, you can see their account. All their photos and media that they posted is gonna appear in the news feed. And that is the first tab on the far left down the bottom, which is the home icon. The search or discover tab is second. I just click the magnifying glass where you can discover new content. Not gonna go into that, but that's where you discover new people, new content, and even your target audience. I'll show you exactly how to do that. The middle blue button down the bottom 
is a camera feature, so how to upload your photos and take photos to post them on Instagram. The second from right, the little heart, is all the activity that's going on in your account so you can stay on top of it and understand who's interacting with your business. Right now, there's gonna be nothing there, of course, but there will be further down the line. And the final one, ta-da, that is your Instagram profile. There's gonna be nothing there right now unless you've opted to upload pictures already. But for now, it's just an Instagram account skeleton that we're gonna be building on and making stronger and stronger and better and better throughout this entire course. So right there is its beginning, it's an egg. We're gonna grow it into a full-sized animal. Really excited to do that. So I'll see you in the next lecture, which is the Instagram starter mission. Congratulations on getting your account. Now let's go ahead and populate it.